Hi and welcome back to Cut the Craggle. Today we're going to be looking at the new upcoming LEGO sets for 2021. They've officially listed a few of them on the website now, so we're going to take a look at them and see which ones we're going to buy. And when I say where, and we, we, I mean me, I, and Mrs. Craggle here. Hello there. Why did I know you were going to say hello there? Because <laughs> it's me. General Kenobi, you are a bold one. Anyway, what is this person doing? Um, like, what is the face on that? Inspector. And why is she holding the banana behind her? Like, look at it. It's like, oh, hello, Mr. Parrot there. Don't mind me. She's just going to whack it on the head with the banana and <laughs> eat it, you know? Oh. It's very suspicious. Anyway, okay. so we need to go to... What is it? Re New. New? Okay. This is why you're here, to tell me what to do. <laughs> and then we go down to availability and coming soon. So there's 95 sets so far that they've listed on here. Okay, do we need to do a checklist or anything of what we're buying or we're just going to go through them? Oh, we'll just go through them. We'll say yes or no. Yes mm. or no. Yay or nay. Yay or nay. Yeah, thumbs up, thumbs down. Okay, let's go. I probably should have done that in uh, new tab. Anyway, so this is the new Creator Expert modular. I don't even know if it's still called Creator Expert. It might be called 18 plus modular now but yeah this is the police station and what are we thinking about this mm, it looks cool and it will go with your other modulars but it's a police station i'm not really fussed on that i don't know about you uh, i don't know it looks pretty bland i like those one the two by two donut pieces They're these cool. yeah they are cool, but it's... I'd hate the new box art. Uh, it doesn't suit that one very well No, I mean, everyone's going about how cool that is. And yeah, that looks all right. That new modular buildings collection. I mean, that's what it's called, actually, now. Mm. But yeah, I don't like the whole plain black box art. No, it doesn't suit that. I much prefer when you used to see it like in the street with the other past modulars, uh, you know? Yeah, they look really cool. A little bit of rendering. See, it looks better here, because in that first picture, the minifigures are like in front of it rather than interacting with the building. Here, at least, you can kind of get a, a sense of scale. Um, I don't know. I've already got the new stands because there was a, a Build and Take promo for a, uh, a new stand that came out with the, oh, the... bookshop. The bookshop, yeah. Mm. This one's kind of like built into the building, I guess, but... Yeah, it's got a new tile, it's got the... Um, is, yeah, but look, is that... Print? That's a sticker. Is it a sticker? Yeah, because oh. look, see the, the the black line down right here? Oh, God. That's a sticker. What happened to the creator experts being printed pieces? Well, I think they've always had stickers on them. It's not the Lego ideas that they've, uh, they've started doing now. There's another... Yeah, mm. I don't know. The donut shop looks to be the best part of this to me. That's the ugly exterior. They're always so bad at the back. And I always have this empty, like, space here. I mean, I get, okay, it's kind of like a back alley, but to me, I feel like it's just an excuse to sort of skimp out on the piece count, you know? <laughs> so maybe for this one? I really don't know. <laughs> what would sway me is the interior, and the interior just looks really bland from the little parts we see of it. That looks okay, but... Yeah, you can see you can't really see what's inside. It's... This apparently is a reference to the uh, the brick bank because it had a laundrette on the side, which they were using for money laundering. Ah, uh, Yeah, I haven't got that one. That was before my time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these are some like close-ups of the interior. Is he fishing for cops? <laughs> 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 it looks like it, doesn't it? <laughs> I kind of like that. How they've done, like you know. That's pretty cool. Is that a new... That's a print there, isn't it, with the typewriter? The typewriter. That, that looks quite cool. Is it a print? Yeah, it looks like a print. It could be. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. The minifigs aren't that great either. They're all the same torsos. And that face, the winky police woman's face. I don't think any of these are new. I think, well, maybe this torso and that torso. I think two new torsos, which they've repeated that one twice. But the faces are all existing pieces. That's... That, I swear, that's um, that's Jack, a that's, Jesus. That's Jack's um, torso from Hinside. Yeah. And that one was from. Oh, it's the City People pack, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't think we're getting this one. Okay, now we've got this 
off-road buggy Technic set? Well, we don't really collect Technic sets, so I'd probably say no. I mean, it looks really nice. I love the colours on it. But... The colours are gorgeous. And these are probably, yeah, they're yeah, stickers. Yeah, they're stickers. But it still looks cool. And like this one, I think, yeah, you have the Lego Technic controls. So you basically power it up and then use the app on your phone. It turns into an actual RC. That is pretty cool. Yeah. We know someone who may like that set. <laughs> who? Greg. Oh, yeah. Yes. Well, I don't know, because Greg got the remote control uh, Batmobile one and uh, said that true. it was pretty terrible. But yeah, it does look pretty. Oh, my God. They look scary. <laughs> oh. Okay, let's get off this. Yeah, right. that, that, that's a definite note. Hey, that's better. See, there it looks a bit more bland. It does. That's not a great angle for it. Maybe it's just how dynamic the first one is. Where is it? There you I don't know. It looks nice, but... Probably a no. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wow, this one... Is Duplo. Yeah, that's a no. We don't let them Duplo. I mean, we've got the Duplo bricks on Lego house. Oh, look at this. What, Whoa. what is going on there, Lego? Oh, wow. Yeah, I do like the figures in there. They're quite this cool. is one of like the Chinese New Year th sets, I think. Possibly. Yeah, it's got to be, because look yeah. at that. Yeah. Okay. It's cool, but... Mm. Now this one, I really like this one. Yeah, that one. This is the Spring cool. Lantern Festival. So, yeah, because every year now it seems they do a new sort of Chinese New Year set or two. Mm. They used to be regional exclusives. Annoyingly, they've never wide released the Chinese New Year meal, which is the one I wanted. I know, that looks so cool. But this looks beautiful. Let's wait, let me make this full screen. There we go. Look at the print on that red minifigure there. That one. That looks amazing. Yeah. There's lots of new prints in this. Is that Monkey Kid smiling on this torso there? It the Monkey like... King even, rather? Yeah. Yeah. It's that's so cool. good. Oh, the bunny's <gasps> got prints. Bunny. Oh. Yeah. That's a, is that a new phone piece? With someone messaging? Yeah, I think so. That looks like has got arm prints in there. I think you're right. The mm. ball is really cool. I'm just this whole. I love this, like the building design. It just look, is that BB-8. <laughs> it looks like BB eight. <laughs> they just painted BB eight blue and stuck him on top of it. And the bamboo. Yeah. yeah, this is a definite. I just love the orient aesthetic to it. It just looks so so pretty. Yeah, that's definitely on the S list. <laughs> <laughs> We've only looked at the one picture of it, but yeah, I think definitely. Whoa, are those trans. Oh, and they're okay. printed with an ox on it. Yeah, because it's the year of the ox. Mm. Wow. Yeah, then there's the, the brick built ox then. It's actually a pretty cool build. Oh, yeah. I like that. I like it a lot. <laughs> well, I love the uh, the tiled off water. It reminds me of Ninjago City. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. We're, getting, we're no. getting this one. So we're getting the Spring Lantern Festival. So you got a definite yes. <laughs> well, hey! <laughs> then we have Town Centre. This is one of the Lego City, like, they do like a square, like a city square type fans. They do one every year. Mm. I don't know. I don't think we're going to get this. No, I don't think so either. If I had a Lego City, that would be perfect. it'd be stuff good that you could expand on. Mm. This has also got the new road plate system as well. There are some cool stuff in this. Like, I like how they have the, the blind guy with the guide dog. Yeah, and that's a new dog piece as well, isn't it? Yeah, and it's a new piece for, like, the harness. Yeah. I think that's really cool. It's good to see stuff like that in here as well. This guy's pretty cool looking. I don't know what he's supposed to be. Like, it's like a mechanic? A mechanic slash evil Knievel. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this takes up a lot of room. I don't I don't really see it. They always mm. include like pointless vehicles in this. It has a pizzeria. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think we're getting this. I do I do want to get that. The yeah, minifigure that with the, the dog. Might the guy be a dog. Mm, yeah, Definitely probably, maybe. One. Yeah. At least that's got the... How small is that car? Oh, that's tiny. Is he... It's like <laughs> he looks like he's got no legs. He looks like he's just this torso <laughs> just stuck in a car. Wow. <laughs> I guess that's supposed to be like the... Uh, what are they called? The, the, uh, the paddles. The paddles they, they, they use for the pizza. It looks like yeah. he's got the beater up, though. <laughs> <laughs> It's like a ninja dojo, a dragon dojo above the pizzeria. Okay. Mm. Yeah, this 
it's cool. I don't know. I feel like it might be one that I'd pick up if I saw like go for like cheap. Yeah. Uh. Oh. Andrea's family house. No, he don't collect friends. No. Not any interest at all in friends. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. The woman has spoken. <laughs> And, okay, Ninjago, Zane's Titan Mech Battle. What do we think of this? That looks cool. Does its knees move, though? Because mechs and knee joints. It looks like it has some articulation, because that one's quite straight, whereas that one's got a little bit of a bend to it. Yeah, so it has some small movement. What's this, though? Like, the ten Ten year Ninjago. Ooh. I hope that's a printed piece. That looks... It's right to the edge, so I think it might be a printed. I love this tail piece. It's like the ghost oh. one from okay, uh, Inside. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I but it's dual the molded. Wait, the side's like dual molded as well. Ooh. This might actually have to pick up. It doesn't look too bad. I like the head on it. The head looks very much like Transformers to me. <laughs> it's cool box art. Yeah, it's Ninjago Legacy, so it's when they do sets based on the old seasons. Yeah. That's actually pretty cool. They're good looking minifigures as well, to be fair. Like, I've got so many Ninjago of the ninjas themselves now. Even as a casual fan, I just picked up the odd set. But those look pretty decent. Mm, they do. That's quite cool. I don't know if we had the mask piece to wrap in that, that colour as well. No, it's normally in the as a, like black, blue, and mm. red ones of the white. The Gotar and the Soul Archer, they're called. And you've got the Zane and J Legacy. I think this might be a maybe. Yeah, I like the this one. I don't know. The, the mech itself gives me a mixture of uh, both Transformers and also Power Ranger vibes. <laughs> yeah, it does a little bit. Okay, so that's a maybe. That's a maybe. A strong maybe. Uh, the creative birthday party Duplo set. Um, Duplo don't collect again, <laughs> so... <laughs> okay. These are not in any order, are they? No. The Steve Fire Command Unit. Mm, don't really catch much city stuff and... It's just a fire Why is there kryptonite in here? <laughs> if I go crazy, then will you still call me Superman? <laughs> Feldman and Bob. Oh, Bob. 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 <laughs> Bob. What noise does a goldfish make? Bob. Bob. Yeah, so that's a no. That's a no, yeah. Yeah. Then we got... Um, yeah, you know what, <laughs> of course I'm going to get Lego this. Super Mario Master Your Adventure Maker Set. Yeah, that's a definite yes. It's Mario. I love the Super Mario stuff. This is pretty cool. This is the one that has the new um, pipe or tunnel piece mm, that so you can set the rules slightly different, I think. Yeah, so rather than the 60 seconds you get, it changes it to 30 seconds. It's like a speed run. Um, mm. It looks fun. I love the little... The fact you get a paragumbo as well. I keep calling that Yellow Yoshi oh, and you keep not, telling me off. It's not a paragoon, but it's a paratrooper. Oh, okay. Well, you got it wrong then. You tell me <laughs> off. It, uh, that's this Yoshi, but yellow, right? Well, yeah, kind of some species, but... Well, look, it's the, uh, the poop person. It's a Goomba. Oh. It's a Goomba. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> Lego Mario is not included. Yeah, it's pretty cool. For like £50, it. Pounds, it looks like you get a lot of bang for your buck there. Oh, yeah, definitely. Okay. Yeah, it's a definite yes on that one. And then we got the Lego Classic Creative Building Bricks. No. No. We only no. get those if they're on like cheap, cheap offer. Yeah, because it's cool to see the amount of pieces you get for it, but... But a lot of time it's stuff that you don't really use anyway. Exactly. The Lego City Family House. I kind of like this. I do as well. Do you know there's one thing in particular I really love about this? That hat and hair piece. Yeah. <laughs> I love Parker's hat and hair piece in a new colour. Mine's Can imagine that's Parker's hand, uh, hair before she dyed it. <laughs> and they got them playing street hockey. Yeah, it's pretty cool. But again, it's, it's like, for me, it's not an obvious place that I could put this on display or mm. I don't know, I wouldn't know what to do with it after I built it. The new dog piece again now, isn't it? Yeah, mm. I just want to go for the dog piece. <laughs> the turd. <laughs> the poop piece. Oh, they've got that torso back again. Oh. The one, that's oh. One, like oh yeah, that yeah. Again. That's from Ninjago City, right? I, think I swear, so. one of the, like the boys has it. Quite possibly. That's a new toy. That, that looks new. This is the one from Jurassic World, which they've really got their money's worth mm -hmm. out of. They've used that on so many different sets. 
Yeah, I mean, even from the back, I don't think it looks that bad. No. I don't. Okay. <laughs> there is no way. How do they get up here? You have to use your imagination. <laughs> use the force. <laughs> yeah, he's got a. A sticker. Is that like a Dungeons and Dragons style poster? It's a sticker, but. Yeah, yeah it does look like it was a Dyson. Wash dragon. your. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's okay. What's the TV? Can we see the TV in it? it looks like a video game on there. It's a bit. Yeah. Oh, we got a control it's got, piece got, as well. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's not a bad little set, is it? No, it's not. How much was it? Forty-four ninety-nine. I feel like if that went down, mm. I want to play. Play. I want to <laughs> pay even around thirty quid for that. I think. Yeah, I don't think it's worth. Quid means uh, pounds, or I guess it's like what Americans call bucks. You know. Yeah, it's the slang we use. The Heart Lake City Movie Theater. Um. Nah. Nah. I it's... do kind of like a little bit the build. I like old movie theatre cinemas, but... I know, we missed out on the past theatre, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah so no. Jeep Wrangler, should I bother clicking on it? No, no I'm not going to get that. Like, no. this. Now this. You already have, like, how many X-Wings now? Two? Oh, no, I have one. You have one. Do I have... I yeah, have the you, Christmas one. the Christmas one. I've got yeah. the orange... No, the grey and blue... Um... One resistance. From, yeah, resistance. So you haven't got an original trilogy one. Oh. I haven't. No. So that's your excuse. <laughs> I don't know if this is the same as before, but this looks like it uses a heck of a lot of stickers. I believe that's a printed piece. The that canopy. looks printed. It has. Oh, but, that's a sticker. No way. <laughs> it's got a good selection of minifigures, to be fair. But these are like the new kind of size down ones. Mm. It's not as obvious with this as it is with the Tie Fighter that we're seeing a bit. But yeah. Yeah, it looks quite good, and you get a layer as well. Yeah, that's the layer that was on the Tanti 5. Yeah. And then General Dodonna, who we haven't seen before as minifigure. Yeah. He's in the New Hope and Rogue One as well. Yeah, yeah. I quite like the look of this one. You think you'd be picking it up? I think so. The back looks rough. Ooh, the back, actually. Yeah. Mm, okay, so maybe. It's 44 99 So it's more mm. reasonable than like the 70 quid ones. Yeah. Then we have Lego City Police Patrol Boat. Yeah, is there anything new in here? Doesn't look like it. <laughs> Maybe a new torso, has that torso been used before? Or? What, what, like the... That one. I don't know. God, why is it not what you think? That's a new face print, I think. I don't know, nothing really here interesting me. Mm, nah, no. nah. Okay, then we got the Lego Spider-Man, Spider-Man's Monster Truck vs. Mysterio set. <sighs> I have no interest in this whatsoever. I still think it's silly when Spider-Man has vehicles. I mean, he just gets around on his web shooters. He doesn't need a vehicle to get around. Right, but what I do like is Mysterio comic type Mysterio rather mm. than the one that was in the Far From Home sets. This That looks amazing, that piece. I believe it's the same piece that came with the Reem in the Haunted Mansion from Lego Hidden Side. Mm. But it looks so different here than yeah. just the green. I don't know if it's trans... Well, maybe it's a little bit of trans green, but it looks more solid. It looks more like slime. You can almost imagine this coming out of slime as he's flying off, you know? <laughs> yeah. Doc Ock looks pretty cool as well. Yeah, he looks pretty cool. I like him. Once again, with these Marvel sets, they are allergic to leg printing. I know. The one thing I do like at this one is the Spider Gwen, but no leg printing. No, I think that hood piece works better than the other one they gave Yeah, her. that one looks a lot better. Yeah, no leg printing, no arm printing. This Spider Man has arm printing. But what, if they did but... leg printing and arm printing on Spider Gwen, I'd definitely get the set. The Just... thing is, with these Marvel sets, the best thing I think are the minifigures, yeah. and yet they skimp out. Yeah. Look at the legs. They're just literally I mean, the legs. colours match, but it just it's so drastically different from having these cool designs that just stop. Yeah. Like, especially with like the quilted like texture on uh, from Stereo. Mm. Yeah, I do kind of wish they'd done some printing this on the inside. So you see the inside of our hood. Uh, yeah, because it has like a pink cool. colour, doesn't it, on the inside? Yeah. But yeah, I don't know. I'm really not interested in the set as a whole. I just like the minifigures, but even then I have issues with them. Yeah, so maybe close to no. Yeah. Okay, we're on to our second page now. Mm -hmm. 
So this is the three in one creator surfer beach house. I'm not very impressed with that one. <laughs> no, I'm not either. <laughs> That's like the derpiest dolphin going. Derpy derp. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Some of these 3-in-1 creator sets I like, and some of them I just think are a bit meh. I don't know. I, I just don't, There's nothing particularly wrong with this set. It just doesn't do anything for me. No. That looks a bit better, but I've already got like two lighthouse sets anyway. I've got the Scooby-Doo one and the Hinside one. Yeah. You know, how funny. many lighthouses do a, does a guy need, you know? <laughs> I don't know if we've had the surfboard in the sand green cut before. I don't, I don't know if I really want it in the sand green. <laughs> uh, so what are the three builds then? Is oh right, I thought that was part of the thing cut off. So is I that like a surf shop, a lighthouse, and the soda bar? I guess is it? What's a surf shop? It's a two-story. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's got. A that is like the world's smallest swimming pool. Look at the diving board in there. Oh my god. Considering they like to say like no diving in a lot of the swimming pools because like, they're not big enough. Like they're in coach now and there's a crab in there. Who's like got the who's in charge of hygiene and cleanliness at this like indoor surf pool? Oh my like, oh my god. Yeah, I don't think we're getting that. No. No. Not for us. Look at Minecraft. I don't collect Minecraft, but this is pretty funny. That that is actually pretty cool, even though we don't have any Minecraft ones. Yeah, this is a giant pig. pig. I like the giant pig. Oh, the little pigs are quite cute. Why as well. is there water coming out of his chin though? Or is that is that meant to be his mouth underneath? Is he just like drooling? He could be drooling. <laughs> we hope he's drooling. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I'm not gonna get it though. <laughs> no. It's cool. We give it that. Okay, we're on to another Ninjago set. So this is the X1 Ninja... Should I start again? Yeah. This is the X1 Ninja Charger. I mean, it's a pretty cool looking car. Yeah. Is that the same one that was in the other one? I hope no, it's a different one. It's not... We had... Was it Jay in the last one? Yeah, isn't that Jay again? No, I hope Jay had blue. No, it was, I swear it was the same gold one. Or maybe she's got the thick eyebrows, so maybe not. Maybe they're all gold. Maybe it's them in diff all different ninjas as gold ninja. Yeah, maybe. Otherwise, the minifigures on here are pretty lame. Isn't there one with the names on right there? Probably. Cole Legacy. There you go. There you go. Yeah, the Mindroid ones we've seen before. They come in the mag. They were in that, like, wasn't a battle pack, but a blister pack. Oh, yeah, that one. K and J. K and J, K and J. <laughs> K and J. That's a minute black. <laughs> Agents K and J. The car looks pretty badass. Mm. A lot of stickers though, but I do like the shape of the front. I love the use of those samurai swords at the front as well. Oh yeah, that's cool. That bit there reminds me a bit of Knight Rider oh. kit. I'd say fit. this is probably a, one of those ones that, like, if it were, oh, the bike comes out the front. Like the, uh, like the the, the uh, bat pod on the bat tumbler, pod, yeah. yeah. I reckon this is one of the ones that if it went cheap enough, it would be like an impulse buy. It's mm. quite long. It is. It's got a good size to it. Like, how many stairs? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve studs wide, not including this little where the tires exceed that. So it's a wide car as well. Yeah. Yeah, I think definitely would be one. Wait till it goes down in price and pick it up when it's on offer. Oh yeah, look, they're all gold. All these legacy ones are them uh. in gold. That's why I got confused. Which one is this anyway? This is the the Boulder Blaster. I swear I've seen a Boulder Blaster before, but I didn't think it was a plane. Uh. Who is this? That's quite cool. I like that character. He looks quite cool. Yeah, I don't know what this is meant to be. I like the use of gold on this. Yeah, it just makes it pop. I'm guessing this has got to be Cole's. Cole usually uses gold and black, didn't he? Yeah, he does. Cole does. It's pretty cool. This just feels like filler. I kind of wish there was something... Like, I'm guessing that's the bad guy. Mm. But he has nothing to combat. You know? Yeah. God, look at that. Oh my god, the detail on him. That's pretty epic. That is pretty epic. So this is Kai Legacy, not K. <laughs> Izo? He's an Izo. 
<laughs> Dude, with that tattoo on your face makes you a real eyesore. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know, I, I quite like this. It is quite cool. I do like it. I think that's a strong maybe. Mm. It's only 35 quid, so that's actually cheaper than the other one. Uh, Heart Lake City Park. Mm. No. no. It's <laughs> no. friends. No. There you go, here's the Imperial TIE Fighter. So this is the one that matches the new size down X-Wing. Mm. I feel it's a lot more obvious with this one. Yeah, it definitely It almost awesome. looks like halfway between... Well, not even halfway. I would say it leans more towards the 4 Plus TIE Fighter than the regular TIE Fighters we've had in the past. Yeah. Yeah. I do quite like it, though. Mm. Do we even have a TIE Fighter? Oh, yeah, I have we my... have the middle micro scale one. We have, oh, no, um, have the... the red and black uh, one. It's a TIE Thomas? Interceptor. It says yeah. TIE Fighter. It's a TIE Interceptor. And then the... Von Riggs? What's it called? The, the triangle one. <laughs> I don't know. Oh. Not the Taco TIE. They're not the... Them. The two that came from Resistance. I got those <laughs> yeah. sets, yeah. <laughs> Terrible well, show, but I like both those sets. <laughs> yeah. It just looks so, so simple. I'm not a fan of that Stormtrooper helmet. It definitely, to me, looks like the Family Guy Stormtroopers. <laughs> I don't know. I, I can't see me getting this. I'm not in the market for a TIE fighter, though. What about you? I like the look of it. I'm sure about the minifigs. I mean, really? <laughs> you get a TIE fighter pilot, yeah. droid, and a Stormtrooper. Yeah. Hmm. Mm, maybe. Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> So decisive. <laughs> I know. And we have this one, which, yeah. Yeah, it's... Super Mario Wiggler's Poison Swamp Expansion Set. Yeah, it's a definite yes for me. <laughs> yeah, it's, the, yeah, it's the yellow Yoshi. <laughs> what, is, what is this? Explain this to me. It's is a... that a nose? Is that a mouth? Yeah, it's supposed to be a nose. Okay. Lots of purple on the floor there. I like those. And it's those new plates in the purple colour as well. Yeah. I just don't see what there is to do with this set, though. Maybe that's just me. It looks cuter there. He just looks annoyed. <laughs> Koopas always look annoyed. You have to jump on that. It their just seems like a lot of empty space. I don't. I don't. I don't know. I'm not the, uh, the target audience, clearly. <laughs> then we have like a classic creative transparent bricks, which I feel like this is a bit of a cop out because it says transparent bricks, but if you look at this, the majority of them are still solid, right? Yeah, they've got a few trans in there, but that, but then that insinuates then that the normal boxes don't have trans in them, but they but do. They do yeah. I'd say it has slightly more than the normal one. Mm. Like if it was a whole box and everything in it was trans, I could see this sound a lot better. Oh yeah, I definitely buy it if it was just complete trans bricks. Yeah. Just because there'd be a well, trans bricks are just amazing. I like them. See, it shows all trans ones there. All oh, right, that's just showing you all the trans ones that you get, but actually you get it. Yeah. Mm. And oh, okay, we got some of these now. So these are the new Lego Harry Potter moments, I think they're called. Yeah, Hogwarts moment. So basically, what they are is like a brick-built book, and it's designed to be like a textbook that that the students would have in Hogwarts. And you open them up, and they turn into the classroom that coincides with what textbook it is. And I, when I heard about these, I was super, super hyped. I was so excited. I love that concept. It just sounds, you know, you can describe that to you like, that's awesome. And when I saw like the first low res images, I was like, okay, they look cool. Now I can see more detail. I'm really underwhelmed. What about you? It's just the stickers get me. Do you show yeah. The stickers in these? All of them have these like square, like panel or window pane sections. And they just have these big, massive square stickers. They're not even printed pieces. I mean, I would say, even if they were prints, I'd be a bit like, eh. Mm. Like, I get it has to fit inside the book. But there's what is there here? Like, so much of this is just stickers, sticker, sticker. All the detail is sticker. I mean, minifigure-wise, I think that's an exclusive. Yeah, I don't think we've ever got him before. Not that version of him, because he changed. Remember, he, he looked like an old man with a white beard for the first two movies, and then they changed him then from the third movie onwards. Yeah. Um, Pretty sure we got a Cho and that Harry. Yeah, Cho. even if we haven't got that com a combination of pieces, there's nothing new with those two. No. And this is a Charms one, you know. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. No, Leviosa, not Leviosa. 
Yeah. I can't do it. You do it. You do better than me. Do I? Yeah. It's not Leviosa. It's Leviosa. I think you said it wrong way round. But it's not the Le wrong way round. <laughs> <laughs> it's just not Leviosa. You said Leviosa. it the wrong way round. Ha ha. Boom boom. Ha ha. Boom boom. I made a funny. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm in love with the idea of these more than the execution, and this one I think looks probably the, the blandest of them all. Yeah, the prices as well, I wouldn't pay 28 for that. No, I feel like these would be like 24 99 max. This is the Herbology class. Uh, again, look, some... What is up with that dude? I have no idea. Look man, I found some cookies in here and now I see rainbows! <laughs> <laughs> that's what he looks like. I don't know. I, I think that's a sticker as well. I was going to say, is that a printed that piece? That looks like a sticker. Yeah. I think she's a new version. I think the teachers in this are technically are new ones. Mm. These are technically new, I think, but there's nothing new about them. I think maybe the torso is new, and they just repeated it twice, but... Because that's Cedric Diggory, and that's Neville Longbottom. Oh. What's confusing, though, is we had Neville Longbottom from this scene in the uh, Lego of Harry Potter CMF series and he came with mid-sized legs and everyone was confused like why does year two Neville have mid-sized legs when all the other year two kids have short legs yeah and so I, mm -hmm. I don't know I don't even think it has like does it have the actual what are they called mandrake yeah mandrake oh yeah it's got a there. printed bit there so it's not got a new it was a, wasn't there a new mandrake piece though that came yeah, recently. There was. And that's not even in here. It was in the CMF series. It was the new Mandrake piece. I like this one more than the charms, but still. Okay, so this is the potions class with Mr. Severus Snape. This one I do like the look of. It's This was the biggest disappointment for me, because this is the one I was hyped for the most. Because I imagine like all these different potions and stuff. And you have a little bit of it there and a little bit of it there. There's but, many stickers. There's many stickers. It's just... Yeah. It just... Uh, and then what is actually in here? This boring... I guess there's a table. Yeah. And, the, and this, the only exclusive part of the minifigures here is the torso for Snape, I believe. Yeah, because obviously he's got plain black legs. So. Yeah, because I think he's had different torsos. The face print is still the same. <sighs> yeah, these are super disappointing. They could have done so much more with this. The last one is the Transfiguration class. <laughs> this is so bland and underwhelming. It's hard not to be disappointed. I'm trying to see the positives here. If you think about it, it's just the main build and then little pieces thrown yeah. around in, here and there. These are not worth 28 quid. No. McGonagall, I think, is a new one. Is that right? Someone told me. Yeah, because he's got Literally. the hair. Yeah. Yeah, McGonagall's cool. I love her robe. Those Ron and Hermione figures, though, are so overused now at this point. Yeah. I don't like it. That's cool. You showed you how it all fits in together. I like the colour on this, the, the, the nougat colour. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So, I... no 20 of those. I think. I, they're going to have to go down cheap for me to get those. Yeah. Okay, let's have a look at this one. The Ninjago Overlord Dragon. Ooh, I like the look of this one. Do you? I love the look... purple. Oh yeah, the colour's good, but to me it looks really unfinished. It looks like, where's the rest of it? I mean, that's kind of cool. I don't know what piece that is. Is that like all one piece? It might be. Yeah. It was like the um, was it the elves pieces they used for like the um, or oh, the creature in the suitcase, new suitcase. Oh, the yeah. alchemy, yeah. the alchemy one. Yeah, it's only like two different pieces, but that yeah. That, that looks quite nice. God, why does it do this? <laughs> why? I can't, I can't see me getting this one. I think I just like the colours, but yeah, when you look at it now, like with the the actual dragon, it does seem half it's, finished. It's pretty cheap, it's twenty seven ninety nine. Mm. The Tournament of Elements. Hey! It's you! <laughs> when did you get a Ninjago set? I'm in a Ninjago set! <laughs> wow! 
Okay, this looks all right. I mean, God, we've had so many of these like sets where, do you know the Ninjago ones? It has like a wall and like two ones come off the side. This is a little bit more complicated. That looks like Eevee from Wally. <laughs> it does. Eevee. What is this dude? Oh, that's cool. The Tournament of Elements, I feel, was in the Ninjago pack or Ninjago level in Lego Dimensions. I can't remember. Let's have a look at the minifigures. This could be a good one for me figures. Look at oh, me. Oh, look at that. I don't have tattoos like that on me, but... I'm th that. So first they made a brickhead of me, now they've made a minifigure of me. What next? A buildable minifigure. There's that weird guy, it's the eyesore. <laughs> the eyesore. <laughs> next to Krago, you're a real eyesore. <laughs> oh my god. This guy, he looks like he's from Sinbad or something. Yeah. Is that the new colour for the turban piece? I think so, I've never seen it in that colour. This is really cool, the, uh, the new uh, Lloyd hair and bandana piece. Peace, 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 peace out, dude. Peace, peace out, peace out. <laughs> Make love, not war. <laughs> I love the um. This guy. one, he makes me think of like um, what's it called? Uh, oh, that eighties band. Is it Adam and the Ants? When it was Prince Charming, Prince Charming. Oh, I can't remember. It definitely looks more like sort of eighties glam rock, new romantics type thing. You know? <laughs> yeah, I like it. <sighs> they're, they're, this is cool. So apart from the build. Yeah, the build's, the build's alright, it's this here or there, is it, you know? But yeah, those minifigures, I think, yeah, it's a definite for the minifigures. Oh wow, he's got the, uh, like, Ooh. I think, were they, no, they're not ones that were used for Doctor Strange, are they? I don't know. Mm. But also, guitar piece in white, have we had that before? I don't think we had, no. Bolobo. No, it's Craggle. They spelled my name wrong. Let's just send a strongly worded letter to Lego. Hello, on. Mr. Lego. I wish to register a complaint. I bought this pigeon from this very boutique not 30 minutes ago. <laughs> and points to someone who can guess that reference. <laughs> Five points to Gryffindor. He's going for a snooze there. He's like, you are boring me. I yeah, I think this is definitely... Yeah. It's only 27 to 9 as well. Yeah, okay. Two yeah. months of events. Add okay. it to the list. That's going to the list, yeah. Okay. Oh, wow, wow. yeah. We're going to fight over who gets to buy this, aren't we? But I've already got a baby Yoda now, so... So you let me have this one? Yes, yeah, so you can have this Yay! one. Yay! Even though I don't have a Mando. Best Scar so... Mando. Yeah, the one thing that annoys me, though, is I wish they would print the line down the centre of his helm. Yeah. Because unlike Bobber, he has that line. I mean, technically, it should be moulded. Mm. But finally... I, I feel like this was meant to be in the Razor Crest set, mm. but they didn't get it on time because the original description for the Razor Crest said a new for fall 2020 Mandalorian minifigure. Yep, and it, was and it wasn't. It was the same one that came out in fall 2019 no, the with the ATST. The only exclusive was the Grief Cargo, wasn't it? It was the only. At the time, Baby Yoda was exclusive as well. Yeah, true, and then. But then, like, he came in the Baby Yoda. yeah the big UCS <laughs> Baby Yoda or Grogu. Spoilers. I wonder if they're going to actually start calling him Grogu on the next lot of Mandalorian waves. Well, the next lot of merchandising. Yeah. yeah I don't know. Because they trademarked the child. Yeah. I don't know how you can trademark that as a name, but... This is a quite... I mean, the speeder, I think, is a really good build. I love how you got the child there, oh, Grogu. Oh, he looks so cute in that. He does. Uh, so, yeah, I love the, the speeder bike. I love the Mando. The... Oh, I've forgotten this called now. Is it Ballista? The giant crossbow. You should know this. You know, the siege weapon. That's okay. There's no great dragon to fight with it, though. No, but okay. I don't get why we got half of a Tuscan Raider hut. Because we never saw their huts. They were camping out in they the open camping, in yeah. the episode. I mean, come on. A Lego Star Wars set being inaccurate isn't he heard of. Oh, never. But yeah, that Beskar Mando is pretty oh, cool. He, he has arm printing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Although underneath he has the plain black head. They still haven't given him a face for Din Djarin yet. Mm. This definitely would have been better if they like ditched something and had... Like, it looks like it had the Tusk Raider versus Mando, which doesn't happen. Mm. But uh, yeah, they should have given the uh, the Cobb Vanth speeder. Oh, that would be pretty cool. Do we actually have a Tusk Raider? No, this is a newer one. I think it came in the Micro Fighter one. So yeah, oh. that's a definite. Yeah, definite. It's Mando. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, now we have the Airshow Jet Transporter. Mm, no, it's not interesting to me at all. <laughs> it's so boring. Yeah, let's get off that. 
the fire rescue helicopter? Mm, nah. It's, once again, <laughs> helicopter builds not really fussed on them. This is what I know you're going to want. The oh. Heart Lake City Organic Cafe. Yes, I'll take ten of them. No, I'm joking. <laughs> okay. You okay. didn't even trust me <laughs> to realise that was a joke. Oh my god. How long have we going for? This is going to be a long video. I'm going to have to speed through some of these. Yes. No. <laughs> okay. Yes. The Piranha Plant Puzzling Challenge Expansion Set. It's Piranha Plant. He's mm. cool. Is he? Yes. Okay. I mean, I knew Super Mario was cool. The Race Car Transporter. Uh, no, and those race cars look What is so... it? It's not even like... Oh, it's a 3-in-1. It's, one. One, it's not many things scale. They look it turns so into a tugboat and a crane. I'm not seeing twenty four ninety nine there though. No, no way. No, no, thank you. No, thank you. The skate park. Oh, now this one. See this one though. I feel like it's one of those things where if I start breaking this down, I'll talk myself out of getting it. Mm. I look at it as a whole and go, "That is cool. I want that." But then when you look into it, it's like you have a bit of road on the road plate. That's this year. It's just one of the road plates. You have like a quarter pipe, a palm tree. And a really crappy vehicle. She had to have a vehicle. Um, hmm. Even the minifigures, if you look at it, you have like, is it the citrus? I can't remember what it's called, but the orange, like, torso that came with one of those race car ones. You have the. Uh, the first time I think we've seen this torso being used for a minifig that isn't Tooth Domino's, because it's like when the design is Sig Fig. Yeah. And he put himself as a character in Hinside, something yeah. which I would never do. I'd never like, <laughs> no. in, you know, I'd never write myself into a Lego franchise. Oh no, of course not. And he's also in the um, haunted house oh, fairground the, ride, the drop yeah, ride. The big one. Can't really see what toes he's got. Well, I love the the wheelchair, the red and green. Yeah, that is really cool. I wish that was a printed piece. Yeah, it's again, it's one of those ones. The more I look at it and start breaking it down, I'm gonna talk myself out of getting there. Like even these aren't printed. I'm guessing she's what, what's it called? Something Rush? Vita, Vita Rush. Rush. Vita Rush. But I do like it. Mm. I feel like it's a set that is more than the sum of its parts. Yeah. Probably might be one to get maybe when it's been on offer or something. <laughs> Sick <laughs> moves, <pieces>. bro. <laughs> and she's the rest with pieces. Yeah, I mean, it's only 25 to 9. Mm. Okay. This one I'm not so sure on because. <laughs> It's... I can't believe it. It's got stickers. And there's no exclusive pieces. What is the point in a Lego dot set that comes with stickers? Like, the, the main draw, at least from my point of view, for dots is the printed tiles. Yeah. And even then, this is a cupcake that you can't eat. So we're taking away the, the, the dots. What's the point in dots? Printed pieces. No, we're taking that away. What's the point in cupcakes? Eating them. No, you can't do that. <laughs> this is like doubly pointless this set. I guess we're looking at here they're supposed to be used as storage like the little pom poms in the pink one. So, Who so looks at a cupcake and goes hey that would make a really cool storage solution? No. Not I... even Ikea think of that. No I'm sorry if I see a cupcake it's not a storage it's in my belly. <laughs> I want to store the cupcake in my belly. I don't want to put anything else in the cupcake. More maybe more cupcake. Mm. You know cupcakes inception maybe. <laughs> cupcake inception? I don't know. <laughs> But yeah, that's, just, a no. that's a no. The animal trainer. It's cool, it's like that new piece on the giraffe, but we don't cut Duplo. No. We don't? Okay. Yeah. We don't. No, of course not. This, yeah. It's Chain Chomp. Yeah, but he's supposed to be round. He's supposed to be round, but he looks cute. Does he? Yes, he does. I think you're a bit biased here with Super Mario. I think you're just blind. <laughs> I'm not blind. You're blind. I don't. It's. I don't like the friend's <sighs> animals, they just look creepy. It's the eyes. That one doesn't look as bad, he's got... Yeah, that, that one looks... That oh, one's how to unsee. Okay. The fire ladder truck. <laughs> Another <laughs> fire truck. Doesn't every fire truck come with a ladder? I mean, isn't yeah, that like it, part of so. the requirements of being a fire truck? <laughs> uh, okay. A holiday camper van. Hmm. Apparently this is like a third one because apparently... Like, he is the child that was in the previous two sets. Like, one of them, he's a baby, then he was a kid, now he's the father. Oh, okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. so. Mm. It's a cool one, though. It's a cool one. Seventeen ninety nine. not bad. I don't know what I'd do with it, though. No. 
Nah. Eh. Uh, technical ones. Grave digger. This one I'll be tempted to pick up just because it looks really cool. I like it, and I don't really like Technic normally. It's a pullback one, so it's not going to be like the RC one. Nah. These are licensed ones, though, from Monster Jam, because Grave Digger, I know, is one of the ones Clark has, Toy of. Yeah, he does. Is it Grave Digger and there's a Bone Shaker as well, yeah. I think? This is Max D. This is quite cool. It reminds me of Mad Max. Why, because it's got Max in the name? No, just like the <laughs> colours and the spikes and stuff on that one. Mm. What's this? Race Buggy <laughs> Transporter. Um, looks pretty bland. What a light! What? I think those are prints. Those ones there. Those are stickers. Yeah. Have mm. we had that? Her hair piece and that color before in brown. I'm not sure. I remember seeing a lot in blonde a lot. Um, really? I remember in, in ginger. Wasn't yeah, because it's Claire Deering's. Pop? Yeah. Hmm. Maybe. Yeah. It's quite cheap. Oh, the road plates. Yeah, this is something I don't have any use for. No, if when you're I in get the city, Lego City, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, brilliant. But I do like how you can customize them, like with the speed bumps and stuff. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay. This the one. Dot secret holder. <laughs> this one I do actually really like. It's so cute. It's, I don't think it's any exclusive piece, like prints and stuff, but it just looks cute. Yeah. I love it. It's pretty cute. I'm not really of a cat person. I will but... say though, these are so cheap. The the containers, the plastic oh, yeah. ones, they're like I feel like the disposable ones you get with a Chinese takeaway. They are quite flimsy. Yeah, they're not like meant for like long lasting storage, are they? Mm, no. So yeah, that one. Yeah, that's a definite. Okay. Oh, another Spider Man one. Uh, I think this is a no. I already have a Carnage minifigure. Spider Man, not bad. That is an ugly Ghost Rider. Yeah, I don't He's like the that. second Ghost Rider, the one that drives a car. Yeah. I think he's an agent of the shield. Gabriel's, I think his name, I can't remember. The car, though, it looks a bit like the Im Impala from Supernatural, which yeah. I use as the inspiration for um, Pitt's car, Dragon's Breath. But it just looks too boxy. Yeah, it just... And like the stud shoes on the front, they've tried to mask those in as like a hood ornament, you know, or a hood vent, but... Yeah, it just doesn't work. Nah. Again, well, he's got leg printing. That looks more robotic than a skull. I don't like it. Yeah, why don't they use like a trans-orange skull? Or oh, the trans-orange heads and then... What, and then Peter White? Yeah. You're a Lionel Lego painting something <laughs> <laughs> opaque there. Wow, well, yeah. You've seen yeah. The stuff beforehand. The Superbike Creator, number no, three and one. Nah. No, not for me. I mostly go for minifig scale sets. Very rarely do I go for stuff that isn't. Look, Carl pieces. Carl, Carl, <laughs> Carl, that's a freaky bunny. That is a freaky bunny. I don't like that. No. 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 Didn't even see what title it was. <laughs> no, it was something to do with vet rescue. I think it was. You have the Police Prisoner Transport. Mm. What do you think of this one? It's just two, well, three vehicles and three minifigures. Yeah, I can see kids gonna kick out of this. You get like the police. One. Yeah, you get you know the police transport. You get a little um, getaway car. You get a bike as well in black, which is quite cool. But I see a sticker on the bike. Yeah. I hate stickers on bikes. I don't think we're gonna get it. No. But. I appreciate for what it is. Fourteen ninety nine again. Four many figures as well. It's good value for money. The tractor. The tractor. Hmm. What do you reckon to this one? Um. It's. A tractor. Yeah, it's a cool build, I guess, because it's a cool tractor. But I don't. Really I do like the look of the tractor. Yeah. It's a decent size. I think if I had like a, a farm display, this would be perfect. Yeah. I don't. Okay. The Wild Lion. There's another one of those three and one craters. That uh, is a really cool build, though. That is a pretty cool build. I, that, the eyes there are really good. That is cool. Is that like an ostrich and a yeah. warthog? Oh, okay. This one we might have to get. That I just realised cool. something. That's supposed to be like a carcass that he's just like been <laughs> munching on. That's grim. Lego. And there's a vulture. <laughs> yeah, we, we got to get this one. This one actually looks pretty cool. They call me Mr. Pig. 
Yeah, I think it's not too bad for fourteen ninety nine as well. Okay. Oh, should I click on it? No, it's okay. friends. <laughs> All right, then. dot secret boxes. Now this one. Oh my god, there's eyes on this thing. I didn't even yeah. notice that. Oh wow, that's creepy. <laughs> this one I'm quite interested. I mean, the pieces obviously has got in the actual box. I think those cat ones come in the another. Bracelet. One of the like bracelet ones, weren't they? Yeah, it's one of the bracelets. But it does seem quite cool. I like the look of it. Yeah. Yeah. I love the teal colour as well. It's just really nice. I'll add that to the list. Yeah. Twilight Tonight's not bad. No, it's not. <laughs> I like the cube ideas, but I think it was from Friends. Yeah, no. No. Not for me. Okay. Beach Rescue ATV. Uh -uh. Pretty bland. Don't like it. I think it's a 4 plus. No, it's not no. a 5 plus. Okay. Ah. No, it's not nice. Okay then. Captain America Mech Armor. What do you reckon? Mm, I'm not sure. I'm not a fan of mechs, to be honest. Why? I don't mind them. I can take or leave them. But look at that. That shield piece. That's that printed shield. as well. Yeah, that shield piece is quite That's nice. That's going to be great for like mock users. You can have, like I don't know, on a wall or something. Yeah. I don't I think that one there's a sticker. Mm. Maybe not. This doesn't look like a sticker. Now it looks like a print. At least now with the Captain America having the helmet separately, that they're not getting the really pale face that they were. Yeah. I think it looks pretty cool. So you'd be picking it up? I think so. I mean, it's not, was it like nine ninety nine? Something like that. Let me have a look. Uh, I like that pose with the, the shield on the yeah, back. Yeah, that's, that's a deck. Oh, eight ninety nine. Eight ninety nine, even better. Oh, there you go then. Yeah. Not bad. Cyberdrome. That's a three and one, is it? Yeah. Why is this pretty big? I like it. It's like a space. It's got a space logo on there as well. And it's got a trans like robotic head. Ooh. Yeah, it's a three and one with a minifigure. Oh, okay, this one actually looks quite Cyber drone. So that's the I mean, I don't know why it's a drone, because the whole point of drones is they don't they don't have a pilot. No, they don't. I mean granted he's a robot, but they don't even have a robot pilot, it's all just remote control. Yeah. And that's only eight night as well. Yeah. Okay, but that's that's actually quite tempting. Nah, not gonna look at that. <laughs> uh, epic battle set: Cole versus Ghost Warrior. Um, That's one of the small. Oh box wow! Ones. Okay. The little cardboard cases things. Oh okay. I don't see eight ninety nine value in here though. No. <laughs> He's got a little wooden pitchfork, and <laughs> what, what the <laughs> hell is this? I feel like this a very one sided battle. Yeah. What? What's Oh, he's got the spin things. I think you can spin them. Oh, okay. Yeah. I don't think we're getting that. No. Okay. There's another one. I think this is like a series epic battle set. J versus Serpentine. Ooh. Oh, that's actually quite cool. I think you had the Serpent like figure like that in... I think that's the sand blue colour. I don't think so. Oh, but that one actually looks really nice. I really like that minifig. Even like... The J minifig, I don't remember have seen that torso kind of design before. Oh my god. Lego just wants to destroy your soul. No, I think that one actually That's pretty cool. I that, think that, that might, might be on the list. Might be on the list. Not much of a build, but <laughs> I mean that's kinda of cool. It's like a cobra. Yeah. No, is it a cobra? No, what's it? Yeah, a cobra. Yeah, cobra. Yeah. Okay, so that's maybe. And then we have another epic battle set. Kai versus Skulkin. Skulkin, yeah. Skulkin. Uh, hey, what are you skulking about? Eh. <laughs> uh, not feeling this one. No. No. Me neither. Okay. Oh, yeah. Almost missed one out. This one is the Zane versus Nindroid. I'm not really feeling this one either. No, I like the accessories because that translucent blue, but. I'm not interested, it's just, just... Yeah, I'm not fussed on that one. Fire has a truck. No, I just... <laughs> <laughs> I thought for sure you are going to go for this one. No. <laughs> no? No. Okay. No, definitely not. That one? No. Okay. Miles... Okay, now this one. Miles Morales mech armor. Yes, because we haven't got a Miles, have we? Or do we? Oh, I don't know. I think we got a Miles fig. I don't think so. I really like this Miles fig though. He just looks. In fact, cool. he has like the hoodie on with the, the spidey suit underneath. Yeah, 
The mic doesn't look too bad. I either. swear that is a sticker. It looks right to the edge, though. <sighs> yeah, maybe. I think that could be a print. The mech on this one actually is a better build, I think, than the other two. I like how they've incorporated the web pieces. Yeah. It's got dual molded legs as well. Ooh, okay. Yeah, this is a definite one then. Yeah. It's Miles, and also that mech does look pretty good. Cool. Okay. Ooh, page five now. Page five. The Millennium Falcon Microfighter. Well, we've already got one, or we got two? I've got two. You got two? Yeah, I got the original one with Han, and I've also got the one with Chewie, which is based on the sequel trilogy, because it has the rectangular uh, dish. Mm. This is based on the original trilogy, so it's kind of a remake of the, of the first one. The only major difference here I see is Han having the new hairpiece, because that yeah. old one came with the smooth style mm. hair. I think there's some like a little bit of... Like difference around the back. I'm not for sure. I mean, like that, how they do the uh, the blue at the back. Yeah. But no, I don't think I'm gonna get that. No. I don't think there's anything significant in there that's worth me picking up a third one. Nope. Nah, not that one. Penguin um, Mario Power Up Pack. Yes, because the penguin looks adorable. He's, <laughs> He's pretty cute. <laughs> he is adorable. Yeah. That's quite it's cool. It's a must. And there's actually the the actual Power Up Packs are really cool. Even though obviously it's, you only get so many pieces in there, it just looks really nice. I like him. You like him? I like him. You like him? Yes. <laughs> this is the Lego City Police Helicopter. Nah. I swear those two characters came in like a riverboat set years ago. <laughs> They're so generic. They come in like a gazillion different sets at this point. Yeah. Uh... This is a Technic one. Yeah, I like the look they're, of it. They're going really all out now with the uh, with the colours on these Technic sets. I know, just like the teal and orange, just it looks so good. So I'm like, we may have to get this. Another Technic we have to get. You think? Yeah, I think so. Eight ninety nine is a bargain as well. Mm, exactly. Lego City Roadwork Track. <laughs> Okay, I guess they're appealing to kids now with these ones. This is, def this is a four plus. plus. Yeah. Nah, nah, not for me. Got another uh, Technic one. Oh. Skid Steel Loader. Mm. Um, I can appreciate it, but I don't think that one's yeah. for me. No, yeah. no. Spider-Man and Sandman Showdown. This is a four plus one. Yeah. Yeah. Not that I completely write off 4+, plus. I've had a couple of before. I do love, I still haven't got it yet, the, uh, ah, fail. That was a <laughs> colossal <laughs> fail. <laughs> These ones don't have pictures of just the minifigs on their own. No, they don't. But. Did you want to go full screen? That would probably be easier. <laughs> that yeah. piece is quite cool. Yeah, I like that. It's got the angry clone face. Oh my god, it does. <laughs> they were like, dude, we've changed all the Stormtrooper faces now. Like, what are we going to do with these uh, leftover clone faces? Oh, we've got a few sets of them. We should use them in those. Yeah, it's a good idea. Yeah. Oh, my God. I don't know. I'd probably bricklink the figure. <laughs> yeah. Now, this one looks like, it, apart from the fact it's got no stickers on there, no branding, this could easily have been one of the old-style Speed Champion sets. Yeah, I see. You know, when they were six studs wide before they moved to eight studs? I A99 I feel like it's too much but I feel like if this went down to like a fiver which they sometimes they do in Asda I pick this up yeah I think there's nothing particularly unique about this I love when I give these freaking characters blonde hair and dark eyebrows because <laughs> they dye their hair I think that torso originally came in the corner garage yeah it's what the um, female mechanic wears isn't it the flea male the flea male no I think it's the moped rider isn't it is it yeah well it's one of them no nah. Yes, because it's a tanuki. <laughs> I know, I used to call it a raccoon. It's not a raccoon, is it? What is it? Is raccoon tanuki? flying scroll? I don't know, I can't remember what it is. A, ra a tanuki is raccoon in Japanese. Is it? Oh, okay, yeah. maybe it is then. It's a tanuki, Mario. It's a raccoon. The coral reef. Coral, 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 coral. Coral, <laughs> coral. Mrs. Craggle, coral. <laughs> coral, coral. Staff and fangs. Um, the Coral Reef. <laughs> I don't collect Minecraft, but I think this looks quite cool. It looks quite nice and colourful. I like it. Yeah, I'm not going to get it, though. No, I don't get any Minecraft, so... No. Okay, so we have another Marvel Ooh. mech. This is the Thor. 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 What happens to ice when it melts? He thaws. <laughs> <laughs> mech armour. Um, 
I think this is the weakest one. Yeah, it just doesn't. I, work I right. think with these red triangles, they were trying to like emulate his cape. It just mm, doesn't work. Doesn't mate. work at all. The floor fake's quite cool, but <laughs> is he? He's based on the recent video game, isn't he? I think so. Yeah. But then he hasn't got a cape. They have a top part of a cape on his torso, and he didn't give him a cape piece. That's a bit stingy. And again, no length printing. Yeah, I. And I noticed as well. That is stickers. definitely dear stickers. Stickers on trans You can't pieces. tell me those are printed pieces. Oh no. Wench, do not try to tell me those are printed pieces. They're not printed pieces. Okay, we're in agreement. <laughs> yeah. So that's a no. Hmm. That's a no. Um, Come on, Duplo. No. Okay. Adventure bracelets. They're going in two packs now, but they look thinner to me. They, they actually are. They're thinner, thinner bands, but they come in the pack of two, and they're a pound more than the ones beforehand in series one and two. Mm, okay, I don't know about so, that. That seems a bit sketchy. We're going to make them smaller, give you two, but charge you a pound more. I think so. Like, you share them, so you get one pack, and then you go with your best. You say, oh, you your have bestie. this one, I had this BFF. one. BFF. Yeah, you BFF. They got some cool prints on these. Yeah, this why I like the. Most Didn't they used to only have like four exclusive prints per pack? So I guess they're doubling up on these. Two or three, I thought it was. Okay. So yeah, it's good getting more prints in them. Yeah, I kind of like some of these. Are quite cool. I just hope it's not gonna say you get random prints in each bag. Oh, so you have to get more than one. Uh, I hope not. It looks like you get more than that one though. Yeah. So that's good. Okay. You bought this one. You gonna get this one? It looks quite cool. I do like the prints, but. Root BFF. Just... That's not a real route. You wouldn't find that in the sat nav. <laughs> yeah, this is maybe on that one. And maybe on that one, okay. Yeah. I didn't get all the bracelets from What the about one. the ice cream besties bracelets? I love the tile the um half for the ice cream sprinkle ones. I love those tiles. That's pretty cool. What are these weird faces down here? Why does my ice cream have a face on it? So it says don't eat me, don't eat me. Is that print on the trans one here on the right? No, I think that's the glitter ones they've done. Yeah, but is there like a print of a comic in the middle? No, I don't think Was so. that just a stud from before that they forgot to Photoshop out? Probably this stud from before they forgot to Photoshop out. Okay. But yeah, I think I might get this one. See, I thought the other one was cooler than this, but... I yeah. like how they show as well with the previous series as well. They use uh, those tiles. Okay. Which is quite cool. Okay. Yeah, I, I think I might get the ice cream one. Mermaid Vibes. I love these ones. Look at the shell print. Yeah, are those chrome? Yeah, they're, they're chrome ones. Yeah, there's not as many prints in this one, man. No. The, the first one, which you were not keen on, had the most prints, it looks like. Yeah. Uh -huh. But I do like those. So you're getting prints. this one? Yeah, I'm getting that wow, one. Wow, okay. <laughs> Shows how out of touch I am with the Dots community. <laughs> Monster bracelets. These look a little bit like uh, where the wild things are. Yeah, it does. You gonna get these ones? I think so, because they're quite cute faces on them. So you're getting all the ones by the one that I like. Okay, well, I'm getting get, that one. I may get all of them. You know me, I like collecting all the printed tiles on them. Oh, yeah. I know, I've had to try and s source them for you. Yep. Okay, so there's one more. Okay, Starlight. Starlight. <laughs> this is quite cool. This has got a new piece. It's a tile, yeah. but it has an actual 3D star on it. What? Yeah. If you go to the bracelet here. Shut the front door. It actually is a 3D star on it. That is blowing my I mind. Even, actually, the diamond one as well. Oh, okay. You're twisting my melon, man. <gasps> okay, I thought it was just the one by one tile, but it actually is on the two, one by one as well. That is going to be so cool for like mocks and stuff. Yeah, that is. Yeah, definitely. You can one. see, like, especially the diamond one, they're using that like in a mine set or something like, in the wall. Yeah. You know, it's on, you know, mining for diamonds. Yeah, uh, definite. Uh, and extra dots. I think they got more of them in here as well. So you got the star pieces and also the diamond pieces. Keep out! <laughs> Keep out! Unlocked. Unlocked. Question mark. Hmm. A fox. Sleepy fox. Open eyed fox. <laughs> Reindeer. Reindeer, yeah. Cloud. Crystal ball. Key. <laughs> yeah. Dog. Dog. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm gonna get that one. Cause, like, that's, that's series good. three. Yeah, there was a leak of a series four. I saw well. pictures of series four, and yeah. I was like, "Huh?" Yeah. We're gonna be getting things. all of these, right? Yeah, of course. You got a sh fly shy guy. All right. Okay. I'm going this one. 
Fly shy guy. Yeah. Um, you're gonna see how I'm gonna fail at these names. I don't know what these ones are. Well, that was a fail. That was. You've got one. There's a, there's a paragoomba. I thought you said that was Yoyoshi. Oh, look at this. There's only twelve this time. I can't I believe know. that. But they've got you in it. Yeah, it's me again. I've got arm printing. Yeah, you do have arm printing. Well. I got like this new <gasps> that is adorable like, crab type thing. I like the print of the message in a bottle. Yeah. Message in a bottle. <laughs> they have got some really nice stuff in this. Like series. Aztec warrior. He's got some. Wow. He's got leg leg side printing as well. Yeah. Is that a new weapon piece? Um, uh, could be. I love the shield as well. This one looks like the alien from that episode of Doctor Who, the Doctor's daughter. Yeah. The, the one um, had like a bubbles. bubble thing. Yeah. Got the ladybird or ladybug. I think they call it ladybug in America. Is that a new piece for her back that goes with the neck? The wings, yeah, yeah. I think so. The, the, the hair piece is the same as the bee. The bumblebee, yeah. yeah. And we recently had it in the build a minifig section in pink and black. We did, yeah. There's a centaur. Centaur? Centaur, centaur. I don't know. Half horse, half woman. Yeah. Um, space police. Always have a space something. The beekeeper's cool. Yeah, the beekeeper. I love that printed tile. Yeah, that's pretty cool. The Mardi Gras. I like that headpiece. Yeah. The headpiece is really cool. Cool. Dolphin trainer, apparently, that is. Is that a new tail to the dolphin? Or is this the same one? It's just a slightly different angle. It's the same dolphin, I yeah. think. Violinist. Yeah, so I can get that violin piece. This bomb row is definitely the weakest, I think. Okay. We get a pug. Yeah. With a teal bone. And then there's a plain costume kid in, Yeah, girl. kid in a plane. Yeah, it's a bit of a mixed bag. I mean, I love Aztec Warrior, love the alien person, love the ladybug. Everyone's going mental about space police, so I don't really have that much of a... Mm, he just looks like a space ranger thing. Ninja? Where are you Ra ninja Ra No, ranger. 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 Oh, okay. A beekeeper I really like. Yeah. It's yeah. on me! Yeah, we're going to hit cool. you. Yeah. It's a shame there's only 12 and only like 8 of them I really like. Yeah. Cat grooming car? No. Okay. What about the... Uh... This one I actually do like the look of. Yeah? I don't... Oh, see, I like the idea of the whole art stuff, and I love the Star Wars ones where you can make the big Vader. But this one actually does look quite nice. I like... They're so expensive, though. Yeah. I'm not saying that they're not worth that. I But it's just it. that you have to drop that amount of cash to get it. And you think about it, it's just mainly... Because that's the thing, what I'm saying is, I'm not saying it's overpriced, mm. but it is expensive. So if you're yeah. going to buy something and it's £115, that may be worth £115, but I personally can think of a lot of other Lego sets that I would want to spend that £115 on more. Yeah, like the £115 could go towards the Lego NES, which I really want. So, certain things. <sighs> <laughs> no, I think it'd probably be a case that I'd probably wait until it goes down. Like, the obviously, recent ones, they've had them drop down to like 90 odds. Have they? Yeah, some of them. Oh. I think Argos had the deals where they went down to 80, 90. But it was only like the Beatles and Marilyn Monroe. I just got to mention, you have to buy two if you want to have Mickey and Minnie. Yeah, I probably just want one. Cause what I, is the white thing behind them meant to be? I'm not entirely sure. Like a bone? I don't know. A bone that connects them. Oh, okay. Is, is it supposed to be like the ear? Like, how are they... Well, no. Oh, it's just a Mickey head. No, because a Mickey head doesn't have that big a gap. In the no, middle, it does doesn't. It? I don't know. I don't know. I probably will probably get it when it goes on offer, but I do like the look of it. Is that it? That is it. We've gone through more. We have. Wow. So there you go. That's what we think of the 95 upcoming LEGO 2021 sets that have been listed on LEGO.com so far. Um, so yeah, there's a there's a few we're gonna get. Yeah, quite a few. Some maybes, a lot of no's. <laughs> yeah, a lot of no's. But then saying that, like a lot of the little city sets, they're the kind of ones that I get as an impulse buy if I see them reduced down to like a five. I'm like at the yeah. checkout and I see one for a five. I'm like, yeah, I'll get that. Quick, you know, ten minute build, a little bit of fun, have it, you know, take it apart. But yeah, what are you most excited for? Do you think? Definitely the Super Mario. Super Mario. Yeah. Oh, okay. And the dots. And the dots. Super yeah. Mario and dots. Okay, I can I can see that. <laughs> uh, I'm thinking probably the uh, the Spring Lantern Festival. That's another one they haven't. They were, it went on the website a few months back with the Spring Lantern. It's the other Chinese new one. Oh. oh. And it looks really good. It's on Brickset. 
Yeah, and the it's cool, not but, on here. But I, you're supposed I, to be at the same day, the tent. Yeah, I know the one you, you're on about. I can't think of the name of it, but yeah, yeah that looks that, pretty cool. That one I really like the look of as well. There's a couple of ones in here that I really like the minifigs of, but I think the Spring Lantern Festival is definitely a must-buy for me. Yeah, it's got the build and the minifigures. It's just like, it's a really good set. Yeah. What are you, would you say, most disappointed by that you were sort of looking forward to and now that you're seeing images of, you're like, and... Hmm, that's a difficult one. Definitely the Harry Potter um, yeah. transform, whatever. The Harry moments. Potter Hogwarts moments. I don't want to call them Hogwarts moments. Be Hogwarts. If, Harry Hog Potter moments. You'd even call them Hogwarts books or Hogwarts classes or something, wouldn't you? Yeah. You know, magic <laughs> moments. Um. Yeah, they're quite a bit. They're disappointing. disappointing. I don't think anything else is really disappointing because I wasn't. CMF series is a bit lackluster, lackluster but... Yeah, that's because obviously the drops, obviously a few are... You do have a me. Yes, you do have a you, so we'll probably have to get like three of those. <laughs> <laughs> An army of Craggle. <laughs> so this might be the first year then, since I started collecting the modulus, that I'm not getting it. Mm, maybe. Yeah. But there you go, so that's our thoughts. Let us know what you think of these upcoming sets in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video. And if you haven't already, be our hero and hit that subscribe button. Until next time, laters. See ya.